everyone, this is Grace from Sprinkle of Sesame. I am super excited today because I got a special delivery from LaVan Bakery. I'm not sure if you're familiar with the bakery, but it's a bakery in New York City that has the best of the best chocolate chip cookies. I wish I could just walk down the street and try their fresh baked cookies, but I don't live near the city, so this is my next best option. So here are the cookies. I got four chocolate chip cookies. They're super thick and supposedly they're moist on the inside and crunchy on the outside and they're loaded with chocolate chips. So I can't wait to try these. Okay, so here is the cookie. This is what it looks like. Mm. This is amazing. I absolutely love it. You can kind of see what it looks like on the inside. Wow, that chocolate chip cookie was amazing. Eating that just made my day. But that got me wondering. Hmm, I wonder if I can make something like that at home in my own kitchen. So here is the recipe for the Lavan Bakery style chocolate chip cookies. Begin by adding one and a quarter cup of all-purpose flour. Half a teaspoon of baking soda. Six tablespoons of softened salted butter. One teaspoon of vanilla extract. One egg. And one cup of raw cane carbonado sugar. I like using this type of sugar more than regular white granulated sugar because it gives more flavor and an extra crunch. Then add half a cup of walnuts. And last but not least, one cup of dark chocolate chips, or this is 60% cacao bittersweet chocolate chips. Once all the ingredients are in, turn on the standing mixer and mix all the ingredients together. So now the dough is ready. This is what it looks like. Okay. So I use a standing mixer to mix the ingredients together. But if you don't have a standing mixer, you can just use a handheld mixer or you can just use your hands. Just make sure to wash them before. Next, scoop out the dough with an ice cream scoop. Um, so don't flatten it. If you don't have an ice cream scoop, you can always just use your hand to form a ball. Um, that are about six ounces each. So I made 10 cookies and into the oven it goes at 375 degrees for 15 minutes. Let's take a peek. Ooh. Wow, they look great. Wow, look at them. So let me show you what the cookies look like close up. Don't they look great? So I am going to try the chocolate chip cookie now. Still so warm. 
Mmm. Wow. It is so good. Look at the chocolate. It's loaded with chocolate chips and the chocolate's still molten and has the extra crunchiness from the raw cane sugar. It is super delicious. Oh my gosh. There's nothing like freshly baked chocolate chip cookies. You guys should totally make this. Mm. Thank you for watching today. I hope you enjoy the recipe. Let me know in the comments what you think. And if you like this recipe, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already. See you next time. Mm.